New at six, an uptick in burglaries hitting a popular South Bay shopping mall. Business owners are now demanding more security out of fear that they are being targeted. KPIX 5's Len Ramirez reports from San Jose's Vietnam Town Shopping Center with the story. Len? Well, Ken, until now, this shopping center has not had security on site 24-7. Now, this uh, might be changing now. A mall manager tells me that that is going to change. They will have more security. But if you walk around this mall, you'll see a lot of businesses like this kind of boarded up because they've been broken into by burglars. And some of the businesses have actually been hit multiple times. Uh, here at Tea Life, we've been broken into um, twice in the last 15 days. And she's got the video to prove it. Watch as the suspect walks to her door and breaks through through the glass with a tire iron on Easter Sunday night. Once inside, he ransacks the place, stealing two tablets used for point of sale purchases from under the counter. He even goes into the back kitchen to look for things to steal. Then it's back outside. He meets up with an accomplice who's driving a dark colored car and appears to hand over the stolen goods. The burglar then walks away on foot while the person in the car drives away. The first time around they took our cash register with $200 in it. Um, we don't keep it here anymore. Um, it's completely empty. So this time around they took our iPads. Not to mention the smashed door. On the next block the same thing happened to this restaurant. And one row over they broke in and stole the cash register and jewelry from this dress shop smashing the display cases. In the last month merchants say at least seven shops at Vietnam Town have been broken into. Where are they coming from? Tan Nguyen owns the Trend Salon SJ. She's put her life savings into the business and is like many merchants in the mall these days. Very worried every day. Vietnam Town does have private security, but until now they have not been 24-7. A manager in the leasing office told KPIX that security will soon be upgraded to patrols around the clock. Meantime, business owners can't help but feel like they are being targeted. A lot of times um, Asian business businesses are known to be cash only like restaurants small coffee shops but we're not that type of business and um, they just want easy money now this mall is located next to the Grand Century uh, Shopping Center on that side and the Walmart uh, Shopping Center on the other side and the mall has entrances to both of those side businesses. The merchants are asking that those side entrances be closed because it will give uh, burglars one or two less ways to get out of here if they do commit a crime. Reporting live in San Jose, Len Ramirez, KPIX 5.